This article says Planet Fitness stands by the decision to allow men in the women's locker warns members that their discomfort is not a reason to exclude transgender people. So let's get into today's video. Thank you for calling Planet Fitness. I was wondering what is the protocol for canceling my membership? Well, are you aware of what's like circulating in the news right now? Uh, yeah, no. So in Planet Fitness, a 12 year old girl was in the girl's locker room and Planet Fitness allowed a man in the locker room because he quote identifies as a woman. So, oh, what? so just watch yourself because you're a girl, you're a female. They're letting men in the locker room. I went and looked up Planet Fitness's policy and they're like, yep, all you have to do is say you identify and you're allowed in the women's locker room. So, wow. I, so, yeah, I did not know that. Yeah, that. you're very welcome. Due to your transgender policy, which violates women's rights and safety, I am proud to cancel my membership. At you know, Planet Fitness is one of the biggest uh, gyms in America. I don't know if they're overseas, but Planet Fitness has always been looked at as a joke. They don't have really any barbells or dumbbells. They're basically a gym based upon stupid ass uh, machines, right? Their machine quality is good, right? They use the same machines like LA Fitness or uh, Crunch or all these other ones, right? They have good equipment. But now, the ones have the lunk alarm and these weird policies. One of the weirdest policies that's going viral right now, according to the DailyMail.uk, they have come out saying that Planet Fitness is going to allow like a man who identifies as a female to basically say he's a female or feels like a female and allow him to go into the woman's locker room and change. Would you want your wife, your girlfriend, your daughter, your friend to be changing with some like 80 year old man or some 40 year old freak who has some mental problems. I'm not saying that it's not okay that somebody might go, well, I feel like this. Okay, if you feel like you're a female, that's okay. But if you're like a dude that's like Brock Lesnar, you're Jack, like uh, the biggest bodybuilder, and you're like, well, I feel like a female, so I need to go into the woman's locker room. No, you're a certified pervert and you're a certified creep and you have some mental issues. You need to get your ass out of that And if any of you, yes, if any of you at Planet Fitness watch my video, y'all gotta understand, that's disturbing. How is it okay that you're like, well, yeah, we don't wanna be transphobic. It's people like you that are sick. You guys are like, yeah, our company's okay with uh, men being in the woman's locker room. You know how many men are gonna get their ass seriously whooped by going into the female locker room? Because people like me, people like my brother, people like just the average man might see some uh, weird ass dude going into the woman's locker room and go, yo, what are you doing? My daughter's in there. And they'll go, yeah, but I, I'm a woman. It's disturbing beyond belief. You think Brock Lesnar, Joe Rogan, you think you, me, you think we would allow our family to be in there with another man? Why would another man that pretends to be a woman want to be in a locker room with pervert that's all it is or the people that are genetically like not even in the top 1000 of their like um of their uh athletic career and they're doing some sport they can't even hang with the average man they go into the women's division and completely dominate and they get all the accolades and they're like yeah look at me i'm a badass she's not a badass you're competing against women at the end of the day planet fitness you gotta do better my guy you got to do better because you're allowing the same, or I should say the different sex to go into this locker room, right? Once people start hearing about this, you're going to have a lot of people, not just men, but even women come out and go, yeah, that's disturbing. Like I said, I found out this through a female on TikTok talking about this and she makes a lot of good points. She called the company up, the local gym, and said, hey, you know what's going on? And the, the person behind the counter goes, no, I didn't even know it was a thing. That might make that girl who works at the Planet Fitness quit. So she's not at a place that is dealing with this nonsense. Oh, yeah, if you feel like you're a female, you can go into the woman's locker room. That doesn't make sense to me. It never has, and it never will. 
what makes sense to me is, yeah, you feel like a female, you feel like a man, cool. But that doesn't give you the right to go use the same bathroom as uh, the opposite sex. That There's nothing there that says, oh yeah, it's okay for you to go uh, change in the woman's locker room. Like, if you have junk like a man, you should stay the hell out of that uh, bathroom. You have no business being in that bathroom. You have no business being there. But that is absolutely not okay. But that's just my take on it. Like I said, it pissed me off when I seen the video. And it's, it's nonsense. 